One of the easiest and cheapest ways of getting around in Venice is to use the Vaporetto, the water bus. In a city where most of the roads are on the water, the buses also have their home here. The bus system is well developed and functions the same way as other cities that have the metro or city bus transportation. The water buses are easy to spot, quite low, long and narrow, and with a number in front indicating which route they have. The Raparetto has its own bus stop in most important areas and along all the largest waterways, both in Venice itself and in all the other islands in Venice area like Lido and Murano. The bus stops are easy to spot in their yellow and metal colours. They are small floating jetties with roofs. In the busiest areas there are often two or more close to each other, so different lines can dock at the same time. In front of each bus stop you will find a ticket counter and a ticket machine. You can buy a single ticket for one ride or a day pass which gives you unlimited use for one day. A single trip costs 7.5 euro. A day pass costs 20 euros. So the math is simple. If you're going to use it for more than two hours during the day, a day pass is the best. If you're tired of the crowds in the area between the Rialto Bridge and St. Mark Square, then use a water bus as a nice alternative to go from one to the other instead of all the narrow, crowded streets. It's both refreshing and great. It's also a very nice way to experience both everyday life in Venice and the Grand Canal from the water. We recommend a trip along the Grand Canal from St. Mark's Square to the Rialto Market at the northern tip of the Rialto Bridge. Here you have an excellent view of many of the high-end hotels, Harry's Bar, the Guggenheim Museum and the Rialto Bridge from below. Before your departure at the Rialto Market, a great sight itself. In the morning hours, when the market is at its busiest. As described earlier, each water bus has a number in front of it indicating the current route. In front of the bus stops, you'll find which routes that stops at each stop and where each route stops. If you don't find your routes here, check the other stops close by and we're sure you'll find your departure point. The Vaporetto is also a great alternative if you're going to visit neighboring islands like the Murano or Lido. Both of these routes departure from Mark Square at the waterfront of the Dodgers Palace. Thank you for watching our video. If you want to watch more videos from Venice and the surrounding areas, visit our website allthegoodies.com and our Venice special. Please subscribe to All The Goodies by pressing our logo.